hello and welcome to a bit different video so instead of you know let's play i'm gonna post a small snippets of well chocolate edition minecraft stuff so we'll be focusing on how to craft the ice in this small sub series so let's begin before we begin video be sure to check out our host berry bite they are a very reputable and very good host and let's begin and I apologize if you're gonna hear my keyboard, but I got a new keyboard which I need still to uh, exchange the switches on to silent ones, but yeah, nothing hard to, you know, bear with. So anyways, let's learn how to craft a lost eye. As you can see, we need 9 items. So, let's start. First, you need Heart of Diamond. You can, well, duplicate Heart of Diamond with this recipe if you get one and you can also use those ruby aquamarine and onyx instead of jade now how do you get heart of diamond you get it by killing those little guys and by killing them they will drop well heart of diamond as you can see and as you can see they can spawn in any biome in any light level and to approach to them in survival you need to sneak to them as you can see explained here next item on the list is a hulk hammer so how do you hit the hulk hammer well it's rather actually simple you need to kill the mutant zombie yeah so let me show you so this is the mutant zombie as you can see now if you kill him let me just demonstrate it quickly before he flies away because we are using an open sword if you kill him and if you don't have a fire aspect on your sword, you are gonna need a flint and steel to light him up so he burns down. Because if you don't burn him up, he will just get up. But after you do that, as you can see, we get Hulk Hammer. And that is the second item that we need for the Lost Eye. Next item is Forgotten Head. Now, how do you get Forgotten Head? You get it from Forgotten. Well, that's the name of the mob. And they look like this. They are pretty tough opponent if you have iron armor. They shoot fire arrows, they shoot wither, and I think they get the darkness effect. And as you can see, they have a bit of armor and 60 HP. And when you kill them, let me just demonstrate that, you get Forgotten Head. And yeah, that's that. Now, where do you find them? You find them in any biome below like light level 8, as you can see. And for the best experience, they don't spawn underground, uh, above ground, sorry. So best bet to find them is, well, underground. Where, yeah, they can be found. <laughs> Play on words. And that's that. The next item is Void Quartz. And this one is pretty simple. As you can see, you can get Void Quartz by mining Abyss Quartz block or Abyss Quartz. Both of those items spawn underground and you will find plenty, so this and this other item are probably few things easiest to get. Next item is Glow Shroom, and this one, bear with me, has a complicated crafting recipe. Yes, brown mushroom, red mushroom and glowstone dust makes Glow Shroom. Wow. Same with this item, bomb. Do you know how to craft a bomb? YouTube, don't flag me, this is not some kind of bad video, it's a game bomb. Anyways, voila, you need 4 iron, 1 TNT and 1 string and you get a bomb. Yeah, that's that. This is self-explanatory but if you don't know, in this mod pack there are way more pearls, so as you can see, you can use any of those pearls with blaze powder to craft Eye of Ender. So you will get those pearls by just, you know, killing the mobs everywhere. Because there are like 50 endermen in this mod pack. Next item is Ancient Geode. And how do you find this? Well, it's a bit harder or trickier to find because you need to find stone geodite and then mine it, of course. But the trick is that it's a hard to spot underground, so yeah. But if you spot a bit different stone, be sure to mine it because it's a chance to drop ancient geodite. 
which you need for the first eye. And last item on the list is a rope arrow. Now how do you craft rope arrow? You need a rope and arrow. Just for the reference, the crafting recipe is shapeless, so you can craft it as ever you want. And this is just for the reference. And you can use rope, you can use hanging rope, or you can use rope coil. And all of those things make a rope arrow. And just a quick note, you need full durability rope arrow. In other words, ropes 32 out of 32. So how do you fill the ropes? As you can see, you just surround the rope arrow already with the amount of ropes and it just repairs the durability, so called to call it. And once you got all of those items, you pick them up like so in your inventory. Unless you have some other way of crafting them, you know. Go to your crafting table and just you can shift click in the order and voila! You crafted a lost eye. Wow. But yeah, this was a shorter video, we got more eyes to do, so stay tuned. And yeah, hopefully this helped you to find the resources you need for the eyes and stuff you need and, you know, generally help you out. If you did, leave a like, share, subscribe, and see you guys in the next eye. Stay awesome, bye!